genetically modified product have attracted a large amount of media attention in recent years, and continue to do so. Despite all this, the general public remains largely unaware of what GM product actually is, and the advantage and disadvantage of the technology has to offer. According to the Ministry of Health of Malaysia, GMO is defined to be an organism in which the genetic material has been changed through modern biotechnology in a way that it does not occur naturally by multiplication or natural recombination or both. The controversies and public concerns surrounding GM product commonly focus on human and environmentally safety and labeling issue. Malaysia is one of 64 countries in the world that mandate labeling on GM food. GMO is genetically uh, modified organisms where you have living organisms which have been uh, modified using biological methods. Uh, it can be also part of a living organism and you use those organisms to create something new. Uh, my personal opinion um, I prefer natural original product. Uh, I think I'm an old-fashioned person. I like food to be as original as possible. Yes, definitely GM product has a future. One of the reasons why GM product is produced is because uh, it was supposed to solve a lot of the world's problem. So in terms of food, we hope that um, it can solve uh, world hunger. Well, unfortunately, some people take it a little bit too far. Uh, there's a lot of questions about ethics, uh, whether it's ethical to have uh, big companies come in. So there's a lot of ethics involved. Uh, there's also issue about allergenicity. I guess it depends very much. Uh, I think in Malaysia there's a lack of awareness about GM products. People are not very concerned about it. Um, so in cases like that, of course, uh, nobody really knows. But I think to be fair, all GM products should be labeled so that everybody who has their own beliefs can have a choice of whether to consume GM products or not.